Alrighty, so we're on our way to our fourth uh, NBA with possible entrapment for the night. Initial report was a two-car NBA with possible entrapment. Jim one, ladder four, rescue one, to report a uh, NBA possible entrapment. One vehicle going to a pole. Awesome. All right, so the update is it's coming in as a one one vehicle MVA right, into a pole. Tiny dispatch, put me on location. Angle command. They out on there? He's on the ground, shot from the other side. Police are on scene here. Apparently, this was a gunshot. This probably person was struck by gunshot. It made him crash into the pole. <sighs> hey, on that porch. Go. On that porch. Stay on that porch, all right? KC's wires are live, all right? Don't f around and come off that porch. There you go. When's the shooting victim at? Can I get a light? We slide him over to the What's that? Shot right arm. Right arm and the leg. Right arm and leg? Yeah. Yes, sir. What happened? You got shot? Sean, help him out, Sean. Come on, Sean. You got that one? Yo, any fireman got a light? Yo. Ladder four, ladder four. You have your flashlight? I got it. Yeah. Slow down, man. Slow down. Slow down. I'm good. There's just a bunch of behind me. Manning. That dude took a big hit, boy. Hit that porch, veered off. They all got power. Everybody's yeah, got yeah power. they still got power. Apparently, after he was struck by gunshot, he tried to escape. He wind up knocking down two poles. He ran into a, a porch over there. Then he came into a third pole where he came to a stop. He was out of the car when we got on scene. We can see clearly see bullet holes in the window. We have blood all inside the interior of the car. He was out on the curb sitting. Apparently, he was struck in the arm and the leg. He's been transported by EMS. I returned it over to the police on scene. There's no further uh, fire department activity needed here. This is now a crime scene. So we're going to wrap it up. <laughs>